This is AudioVeek MIDI Tools, and we're going to have a quick look at the bus plugin in Cubasis. Now, um, I've already done a video for Beatmaker using the bus plugin, and that explains all the controls, so we're not going to cover that. You can go and watch the other video, it's only a couple of minutes long. Um, but needless to say, we create a track here, and what we're going to do now is we're going to create a layer. So we want to layer something in with our acoustic piano. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go to our acoustic piano track like so, open up our controls, go to our MIDI effects, tap to add effect, and we're gonna add the bus effect. We're gonna use send post, and we'll turn off record to track because we don't need that. Then we're gonna create a new track like so. We're gonna change the um, the sound to something something different. Like uh, we'll try the choirs, we'll layer up some choirs like so. And then we're gonna insert a MIDI effect we're going to insert bus again. We're going to change it this time to receive combine. So anything that you've actually played already on this track will combine with what's coming in from the bus. Um, we'll leave record to track on because if you want to record it, then you'll be able to actually record the MIDI separately to this track as well. And now when you hit play, you actually found that they're layered perfectly. It's that quick to set up, it's really easily. Like I say, I've explained all the other controls in the previous video, so if you go and watch that, and then you'll, you'll know how to use it in Cubase with all the controls. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video, and we'll see you on the next one.